Can you imagine growing up as a Kardashian kid today? With paparazzi around every corner, your every move being reported on every blog and news channel. Not to mention, everyone on social media is trying to get in your business. As glamorous as it looks, that childhood has got to be rough. Something that makes any childhood unpleasant is all the rules you have to follow. Whether or not they are for your own good, rules are something no kid enjoys obeying. And in the various Kardashian households, the rules are tough. Number 7. No Makeup Kim Kardashian and Kanye West have quite a challenge on their hands if they desire for their daughter, North, to live an even somewhat normal life. With a mother who's a beauty and fashion mogul, the young girl is bound to be inundated with making herself look pretty. But Kanye says not so fast. Kim revealed in a 2019 interview that she had been allowing North to wear makeup every now and then. Kanye had since shut down the six-year-old makeup supply. Here's what Kim told E! News. I'd let her wear, you know, she has a little red for Christmas. I'd let her wear a red lip. Or I'd let her do one pop of something. I'd let her, if she's wearing a black dress, a black lip. Kind of got in trouble for that. So it's now no more makeup. Number six, no microwaves. Kourtney Kardashian is kind of a health nut. She works out hard and eats very healthy. So she's very conscious of what her children are putting in their mouths too. Like many people that go down this road, it can get out of hand. There's a point when they start doing things that make no sense because someone said it really loud on the internet somewhere. One such thing for Courtney is the microwave. Despite a lot of evidence to the contrary, Courtney thinks that microwaving food diminishes nutritional value more than other cooking and heating methods. So obviously, she's not going to allow her children to eat microwaved food. Kim did not get the memo and continues to microwave her M&Ms, which in her own words is life-changing. Kim, you gotta stop. You're zapping all the vitamins out of your M&Ms. Number 5. The F Word Health-conscious Courtney is also very aware of body image issues that can arise in young people and especially young girls. I'm sure she's aware that her kids are especially susceptible to this since they're constantly in the public eye, being analyzed and criticized from every angle. So she's rightly taking many steps to help ensure her children do not suffer from this issue. One such step is that they will not use the F word, and she would appreciate it if everyone else, grandma included, would also refrain from using the king of all bad words. Courtney made this apparent in an episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, and she had to reprimand her own mother for using the F word, for Kris Jenner asked Courtney if she looked fat. Wow, Chris, not in front of the kids, please. Number 4. Screen Time The Kardashian family has just as much reason to be concerned as anyone about their kids spending too much time on electronic devices and not enough time engaging with other people, using their imagination and just simply living in the real world. And just like most families today, they keep an eye on it and limit what the kids are exposed to on their devices and restrict the amount of time spent staring at screens. Courtney was a little more draconian with her kids when they were young and didn't allow any screen time at all till the age of two. Even then, the time is strictly monitored and limited. Number three, no TV. Kylie Jenner is the youngest of the Kardashian gang and has thus watched the public spectacle of her family unfold before her no doubt observing many cautionary tales from her older siblings. Seems like Kylie is a bit more reserved and cautious than the others, hinting that perhaps she would rather not be in the limelight like the rest of her family. She's no different when it comes to parenting, and in terms of screen time, she takes it much further than her sisters. Kylie's daughter Stormy is allowed no TV time. Zero. And ironic when you think that all of Kylie's fame and basically all of her wealth can be attributed to TV in one way or another. But perhaps having viewed show business from the inside, she has every intention of shielding her daughter from that for as long as possible. Probably not a bad thing. Kids these days surely spend too much time watching TV. Number 2. Playing Outside During her pregnancy with Stormy, Kylie found it very difficult to maintain her privacy. Whether it was a body image issue or just a desire to keep her private moments out of the media, the truth was, she basically had to hide out in her house to keep from being photographed by paparazzi. She's used to being mobbed in airports or in public areas, but Kylie was even being photographed from the air outside of her house. After Stormy was born, Kylie was just as protective of her child as any new mother. One thing she had to be protected from was pesky photographers flying over their house. 
For this reason, Stormy is not allowed to play outside. Seems extreme, but as we'll see in a second, Jenner does not mess around with opportunities for her daughter to be unknowingly photographed. If that takes banning outdoor activities, then it is what they must do. Number 1. No Pictures Kylie assuredly spends a lot of time on her phone dealing with social media and that type of thing, but when a guest arrives at her house, she has no sympathy toward the need to constantly in contact with the world of Instagram and TikTok. Not at all. In fact, Kylie makes all visitors hand over their phone at the door so as to remove all possibility that a so-called friend might be tempted to snap a rare photo of Stormy. Now that you've seen some of the rules, what do you think about growing up in that household? Organic, unmicrowaved avocado pudding with Courtney or stay inside all day without TV at Kylie's house? Sounds like a weird childhood, but with the celebrity power of their parents, these kids don't really ever have a shot in a normal, everyday upbringing. That's all for today. Make sure to hit the subscribe and give a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. We'll be back soon, and until next time, no more TV!